Oh, that's a bit. Oh, all right, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. The main event here. And today I have the honor of using the first place national championship team from Hong Kong. The actual team, the creator of the team and the winner of the tournament, Ma Chung Young. Let me use a rental of the team um, facilitated by my boy, Yan Chak, who is a friend of the Hong Kong uh, Chinese uh, VGC scene. And he was able to ask Ma Chung Young if I could use the team to record. And he agreed. So I'm very thankful and grateful for that, for uh, Ma for letting me use the squad and for Yanchak for letting, for facilitating it for me. Um, only conditions was I couldn't like share the stats, which it was fine, right? I'm just not gonna share the stats. I'm just gonna use the team. There's a Karidon team as you saw from the thumbnail. Um, question of the day, do you watch events from other regions, overseas regions, so like Japan, Hong Kong, or Taiwan, even EU, Latin America, do you watch stuff from there? Let me know, um, otherwise, I'm gonna stop rambling on. <laughs> Ignore the question they do in the video because it was uh, wrong. I just fixed it now. See you guys in the first match. All right, so how do I wanna play against this? I feel like screens could be good and some could go dango, but I also think that um, this leading like this and this is kind of fine. Um, Cause I can just get off icy winds into like everything. And then sun, they're kind of like goobed, right? Yeah, they can like set up rain, but they're still kind of goobed they set up rain. And I always switch into raging bolt. It doesn't matter what I want to have is the fourth. It might be, I was going to say go Dango, but I think Ogre Pond is fine because it's good into Amoongus. It's good into um, Butter, Chiyu. Yeah, it's good into everything. So let's go with that. All right, let's see what they lead. Expected Chiyu Flutter. But my Protect is very free. Let's, oh, let's actually pay attention to their booster speed this time. Does Ori Calcum go off before Proto? Oh, we are faster, or is the speed tie? We're faster, or it's a speed tie. She is the slowest, so they're not scarf. They're specs. Or they're just sash. So let's go for the icy win. Butter is not needed to win the game. It just needed to um, get the game rolling, at least in this matchup. So it's probably they probably want to go for either icy wind heat wave or dazzle gleam dazzling gleam plus heat wave is my guess i feel like protect plus heat wave kind of covers for most of that it's just a matter of if the speed tie if they win the speed tie it's kind of goobed no it's not because that would mean that they're locking into a fairy move and a fire move well, both of which i can resist by terra firing so i think i'll be fine so they can protect which is good to know so they're probably sash If they don't icy win here, they're cooked. Okay. If they miss, they're also cooked. Am I goobs if they go for something else? I think this covers everything they might want to go for. Because let's say they tear a ghost, they're kind of still goobing unless they're sash. Unless they're sash. Which could be no, but if they if they tear a ghost and they sash, is that a bad thing? No, it's not the end of the world. But what I'm going for here is I want to go for the collision course KO. Okay, so we break the sash if it is there. And then we um Eat this up like Reese's Puffs. It's good to know that our flutter is still faster than theirs, or it's good to be another speed tie. Um, but they are still faster than our Karidon, which means they are timid. If they were modest, I think they would outspeed. I'm gonna try not to talk about stats too much since I, in the intro I mentioned uh, not being able to release the pace. <laughs> Interesting. Um, I'm just gonna go for this icy wind. And they protect, who cares? Because the icy wind going off, plus the, um, the icy wind, plus the collision quartz will KO. And if they go into a Moongus or something like that, it has to take icy wind plus collision quartz, which is still really strong. Like that flutter is not a threat. Oh, give it to me. 
This is going to take all the damage. My play is a bit unsafe in the sense that one, I need ICU in the hit. Two, I need, if my ICU misses, I still need to be able to outspeed that thing at minus two, which I can't guarantee, which is a bit issue, a little bit of an issue. Oh, you know what? They just cooked themselves. Okay, they boost their energy. That makes sense. Oh, that's a good play. I like that. That's a good play. They're going to waste it with a Shadow Ball, though. Oh, wait. Wait a second. We're speed tying? Are we speed tying? What are we? Wait, what? But they're still faster than me now, which is the issue. Why did we go first this time? Okay, it's fine. We still got him. We still got him. We're good. I need to check the uh, speed interactions while this animation plays. That's interesting. Um. So they must be modest. Um, blank set. And I also outsped myself. Which is interesting. All right, so while I do that, let me get these Pokemon in the game to, um, to win. Is it just like Amoongus? When is Amoongus they lost? Okay, GG's. They lost. So I'll just Draco here. Um, I recover that slot. And that will be not the game because the Amoongus will survive. They have Protect this whole time. Check them out not being um four attacks like us. But yeah, this game is still pretty much over. I just really want to check the, the speed interactions. Uh, right on. Good stuff. Uh, blank. What is our speed stat? So like I expect to go to sleep there, but it's not the end of the world. I'll just click Draco again. Um, still gonna click Ivy. I just don't want to. I don't want to risk a miss with a high, with a power whip. I'm just gonna go for Ivy Kajo. It's very very simple. Click the move, win the game. Oh, you know what it was? I'm minus one and the booster energy was gone because they got rid of my son. But still doesn't explain why I'm faster than them when they had booster. Oh, did I ice you with them twice? Oh, I did ice you with them twice because um, I see with them twice. That's what happened. I'm pretty sure I see with them twice. And that's what uh, ended up being the issue. Why? Why are you stalling out? The game is over. You lost, dog. You lost, dog. You lost, dog. <laughs> like, you lost, dog. <laughs> Freaking loser. But yeah, it was Icy Wind twice. Because one turn, they wasted clicking um, Moonblast into me. Like, I Icy Wind it twice. That's what happened. And then the... Uh, the Protosynthesis got turned off. There's activated, but they were only at, um, I guess kind of plus one, but they, yeah, no, they were at minus one still, just like I was minus one. And we started, yes, minus two, they activated booster. So they went to minus one. We were minus one, but we were faster from the jump. So that's what happened. Got it. And they're minus flutter. I can confirm that based on that interaction. I, it's not like a nerd, but uh, I'm just kind of it's kind of fun going over this stuff in the downtime of people stalling out because they lost the battle <laughs> like in the downtime of people stalling out because they got smoked it just kind of it's kind of fun bop oh and you got crit and, oh, and you get in the button for that and you get in the button for that you get in the button for that one <laughs> because you want to stall out get him out of here he ain't getting no gg well played for that get him out of here we can handle this we can handle this. Uh, how do I want to play it though? Can they deal with um, Raging Bolt at all? They kind of can actually. So, 
it's gonna be this this and then in the back is a matter of what i want to have i think i'm definitely gonna have raging bolt and it just feels so safe to have these four i think when i was practicing with the team i wasn't bringing ogre pond enough and i'm gonna correct that mistake by bringing ogre pond every time it, it, it makes sense <laughs> oh interesting i'm just gonna protect obviously this first turn but like So the opposing photo means so we are speed tying? Oh, did mine go off already? Okay, mine just went off already. Okay, mine has already went off. I wasn't paying attention. Um I'm gonna win here. They already popped Terra, so Terra Poggles cannot Terra Poggles cannot Terra. Terra Pagos cannot Terra. Are they going for parting or are they going for knock? Uh, timid at minus one. Um, Ugh, that could be a bit rough. Um, do I just want to shadow ball them? I think that's fine. Getting damage into the instant is nice. I can always switch out in order to reset any speed drops that I get. So let's see if what their item is on the flutter because it could be booster energy, but I don't know for certain, right? Because my son is what activated their, their ability. Um, but I think they're, oh my gosh. So I've, I, I'll spend them this time. I'll spend them on leads. So I'm just wondering like, what exactly is the um so foot is gone it's just a matter of what exactly was their speed stat right like were we speed tying and i was getting lucky or were you just faster they weren't sash okay my clear amulet has gone I'm probably going to switch my Karadon out. I'm definitely going to switch Karadon out here. I don't want to give up the sun, right? I could switch into something that takes a sturdy. They already popped Terra. I think saving Bolt is better. Icy win here will um get rid of their terror shell. And then after I get rid of their terror shell and drop their speed, it shouldn't be much they can do left. Okay, so Inton is switching out into Urshifu. Urshifu is gonna get speed dropped. Perfect. So even if you were scarfed, now you're neutral Urshifu. I'm gonna go for the KO. I don't have anything to really lose that, that much right now in Sun. And I know we're faster than Terratago, so I'm just gonna go for the damage here. Yeah, Terrapagos can't even outspeed us. Even if they were like timid, I don't think they can outspeed um, two, Timid 252. Yeah, they can never outspeed uh, what you call it. Our um, Karidon. Right 
Earth Hour is insane. So Ensign dies here. Good damage. Dead Ensign. So the damage on Terrapagos is very important. Reason being, um, they can um they can never ever survive the terra shell anymore they can never ever survive collision course anymore like even if they're like super bulky it just doesn't matter yeah protosynthesis is wears off but we're still faster than urshifu the urshifu was not scarfed and they'll never ever get back up to their full health either because of what i have in the back they can no longer win so we're, we're i'm just gonna go for um i think a double into urshifu is fine I think I'm just gonna split my damage. Yeah, I'm just gonna split my damage. <laughs> I'm just gonna split my damage. Get that Ursh out of here. Ursh, I'm sorry. One hit knockout, you gotta get the button, son. <laughs> you gotta get the button, Urshi. <laughs> You like the guy who was protecting with the Moongus and clicking Rage Powder. <laughs> Name was a thought I was going to power up into that spot. Um, but no. <laughs> Here comes another protect. Oh, thank goodness they didn't protect. I thought they were going to try to protect to get more lefties. Like, come on, bro. GG's well played to them. I respect that way more. They uh they they played they played as well as they could given the the matchup was a little bit rough and they had to pop terror on turn one. I think popping terror on turn one really set the team back. Okay, so this matchup is damn near impossible. Um, it's so hard, it's so hard. But because it is difficult, I think I'm gonna lead. It's a matter of do I want to go no because wide guard is an issue. I think I need to lead these and have this and I need this. So this is the matchup that I, I was having the most trouble with it, like trying out the team a little bit. It was just Calyrex in general. Calyrex Pelipper is so hard. <laughs> it's so difficult. Um, So I think screens plus bolt is kind of my answer. The only issue, right, is that screens plus bolt, the bolt being AV leaves it open to fake out party shot by instant, which I don't like, but I don't really have much of a choice besides that. I probably could have brought the sun, but the sun doesn't really help me that much. And I'm also the, the team creators kind of said that this was the matchup into this. Because I'm AV, I think the reflect matters more. So I need to pop this right now. And I have to keep stuff on the field long enough to sell out Trick Room. And they want to go for Trick Room now, they have to take damage though. They didn't lead Insane, which is awesome. That is very awesome that they didn't lead in sin. Because now I get to get this Thunderbolt off for free. Either that or let's say they do protect. They protect, I don't care. Because um, if they click protect, then they don't get a trick room up this turn. So I have more options. Yeah, that's fine. I'm totally okay with that. Because I get this reflector for free and I get light screen for free next turn. Or I could double with like foul play. Depending on how much damage they do with uh, Raging Bolt. This is a lot more than I wanted it to. Radio Bolt could be an issue though, so I guess maybe I um just try to go for the Draco here. I 
I wanted to foul play, but like, if I can just get a full para on any of these turns, it goes such a long way into uh, navigating the end of the game. Especially because they might switch into some like really to take the Thunderbolt because they need to clear the bolt off the field. Even if they switch into. Who's this? Okay, this is good damage. This damage in the instant is so good. This damage in the instant is so good. And they're not AV. They are not AV instant. That's just bulky, but it's not AV. Good job, reflect. Hey, we have eight turns of screens. That's so good. <laughs> That's so good for us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No shot, no shot, no shot. This foul play is gonna hurt. Oh, that's so good. No switches and no protects because they're faster. Did they go for knockoff? Tell me what for knockoff. Grips no east that up. Grips no east that up. Clearing that out is so big. Crit didn't matter. Obviously, we see how much one did. Crit clearing that is so good. Now I can get up this light screen, which is going to be so important. Oh, you know what? I just realized something. I just realized a major issue with uh, a <laughs> with something. I'll go over it in a minute. Um, I think this plus uh, light screen is fine. So I had the rental, but me and Yanchak made, oh, Yanchak, I had to make me a paste, right? The issue with the paste in practice, that is so much still, is that, um, good job, us, is that Yanchak didn't give me nasty plot in the paste, which would have gone a long way in this matchup. I would have clicked nasty plot turn one if I realized he had me with Shadow Ball. Yanchak, if you're watching, I'm gonna message you about this. You kind of messed me up a little bit. All right, uh, light screen reflect has three turns left. We don't need new reflect. We just need light screen. Uh, trick room turns is how many? Two. So I think right here, I just click um, protect. I try to get over Thunder Wave if I can. Good job, good job, good job. Perfect. Now this match isn't over, but I need the bolt to come in basically for free here. I need to power gem this. Um, I think it's safer to just go for the uh, the protect the spiky shield. I wanted to go for an attack, but it's just so safe. 
It's so safe. Now, this is also just going to be Thunderbolt into Goldengo, I think. But with the sturdy there, I could have gone for the Ivy Cudgel. I don't think that they can KO me. I'm going to try to catch him. I want they, they, they have to want to clap me, right? They have to look at my health and realize that like I have nothing. They have to want to clap here. But if I can clap something on their side first, um, I'll be good. That Pelipper has to go for something. That's Terra Fairy. That's Terra Fairy. So here's the plan, right? Which means they're not going for Clap, which is kind of okay. But if Clap KOs the Pelly, why would you protect? Why do you have protect and not wide guard? Oh, I should have just split the damage on its own. I was covering for Sash Pelly. Oh, that's a bit. Oh! We lived. AV Bolt is the goat, son. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you joking, son? I should have just doubled this spot. I should have just doubled this spot. Oh, are you kidding me? Here's the thing, right? Going for the double protect is not the issue. It's getting the double. Let's freaking go, you bum. Let's freaking go, man. Here's the thing, right? I, I, now you guys are probably saying, no, go after the Pelly, go after the Pelly. But here's the issue. I know you're going to do that. One. Two, they don't have protect on this bolt. They don't have protect on this bolt. <laughs> they don't have protect. That's a dead bolt. That's a dead bolt like we doing uh, construction work. Get him out of here. Get him. Oh, get him out of here. As you get when you just click uh, the stupid protect button every time. You deserve to lose 100% of your games. If your whole strategy is protect, 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 you deserve to lose all your games. Just putting that out there. Click a button. Do something. Forfeit. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. GG's well played to us. Get him out of here. All right, so they have. Oh, is this my Florian or some other Florian? Um, I don't know if Florian ever uses this composition. Uh, I think I'm gonna go with this. Do I want to go with that? Funny enough, do I want to go with this? I kind of do want to go with this, and then have like taunt pressure on the. Uh, I think this is weird, but I kind of want to go with this, um, because I can get thunder waves off and slow down the um the bundle. And then once those are done with, I can have these in the back. Maridon and Scizor. That's interesting. Do I care about Maridon Scizor here? Um, because I don't really think I do. What's more important, light screen or reflect? I think light screen. It's also the freest Raging Bolt switch I've ever seen. Like, if you want to go for um, Draco into this spot, you know, be my guess. Because then I will bring Karidon and I will just start clicking Collision Course. Is this electric into um, Volt Switch? It's Fairy. Well, that's good to know. Now we can Thunder Wave that thing. <laughs> Now we can thunder wave that thing. That does not KO us ever. 
it was a good idea though i think you i think that's a a, a play you make ah uh, that's rough but light screen is up so we're fine and we're av bolt yeah we're kind of good we're good um what is our speed here on the bolt i don't think we outspeed even with an icy win they stayed in they stayed in but once we clear them a ride on we're in such good shape it's like am i that worried about losing the raging bolt this turn They just give it to me. Does this KO? Oh, that just KOs. Get him out of here. Get him. Hold on. Get him out of here. Get that thing out of here. This might die too. It stayed alive at one health. We are faster confirmed. That's wonderful to know. That's wonderful to know that we're faster confirmed. Losing the Maridon is so huge. I don't think the Sizzle protects here. I just don't think the Sizzle protects. We'll take it. We'll take that. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. We will take that. We will take that. I'm not overly concerned with um because we have sun hands is a bit annoying i want to get rid of it does not care when sun ever <laughs> this double up has to get him Okay, this does get him. I could have thunderbolted low key based on how much that did. I could have thunderbolted in terrain. I could have thunderbolted. But I don't want to play the games with like AV and the damage roll being weird. Okay, so we're good. We're in the clear. We are so in the clear. That's going to be uh, the game. Shout out to my opponent. I feel like they played well. Um, it was just a shaky matchup on the leads. Cause once they popped Terra Fairy at the beginning, they no longer had a way to resist like Grim Snarl, to resist um Raging Bolt, to resist uh, yeah, uh Coridon. Um, like none, none, they had no ways around any of that stuff. So I'm just gonna moon blast. Um, I'm gonna clap just to be like extra safe. Yeah, they canceled. So um, yeah, they just played it rough. Well played to, to my opponent. Uh, question of the day, which low tier restricteds will be, that should be different. And that's been showing for the whole videos. So you know what? Answer it again. Um, <laughs> I'll change it in the intro and I'll ask it then to um, to something like, oh yeah, that's that's going to be the question of the day. Do you guys watch tournaments that are not from your region? So basically, if you're in North America, do you watch tournaments from EU, Japan, Hong Kong, uh, Latin America, etc.? Um, I do a little bit. Uh, sometimes they can be a little bit long and the time zones are wonky. But when I can, I do. Uh, anyhow, thank you guys for being here. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you once again to uh, Ma Chung Young for the team. Thank you again to Yan Chok for his connecting me with the homie, with the Hong Kong national champion, for letting me use his team. It is an honor. I am so grateful. And thank you guys for being here once again. Click like for your boy. Subscribe if you're new. Become a member if you are so inclined. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.